I love it. Woo! X.com is ruthless right now on Jimmy Butler. Jimmy Butler is getting it, man. Getting it. Talking about, now apparently Jimmy Butler made a statement. If I was playing, Boston would be at home. New York would be at home. And people are going off on him right now. He talks way too much for someone with no accomplishments in his career. Man, you've been the first person saying that. How many guarantees has this man said and he it's never lived up? Look, Dan Kelly at Dan Kelly 66 put Jimmy Butler has been to the NBA has been in the NBA 13 seasons. He's played for four different franchises. He's been to the NBA Finals twice going 0 and 2. His team when he plays in the NBA playoffs 59 and 58 with an overall playoff record 61 and 67. These aren't hypotheticals. And then of course underneath he has the video of Jimmy Butler if I was playing, Boston would be at home right now. And then, of course, they're also ripping him because Jimmy Butler seems more worried about the F1 race this weekend than anything else, which, you know, he has the right to his own life. I I'm not trying to get, you know, mad at him or anything like that, but <laughs> not a good look, man. And they got pictures of Josh Hart practicing basketball and then pictures of Jimmy Butler sitting on a hammock saying, this is Josh Hart, this is Jimmy Butler. Things have changed, man. People are starting to kind of turn on Jimmy Butler a little bit. And I think it's still, oh man, there he is. He's, he's out of the F1 race. He, he's very, very loud and proud of the F1 race and doing a lot of that stuff. I And, and you know, Vlad, you, so, you and I both know when it all changed with Jimmy Butler. When, what was this, um, what was it, May? Oh, no, no, no. I'm sorry. March, because that's when yep, the uh, Mar the tennis. March 17th. The what March was that 30th, the Miami Open? Miami Open. That's when it all changed. I think that's when, yeah, that was the final straw. That's when it stopped being cute. Yeah, because like, they played. Who Was it an important game? Did they lose that game? They too? lost the game, and Jimmy Butler didn't play because he was sick. And now if you think about it, if he, they won that game, they would have been the. Um... They would have probably not had to win the playing game. Yeah. Jimmy Butler was rubbing elbows with Carlos Alcaraz and Neymar and smiling and laughing and having a great time and then can't play the next day. Some 12 hours, basically, or 24 hours later because he's sick. The stomach bug. And I, get, and, and, and I do think, and I, I still to this day say, I think he did have a foot problem for most of the season. I think that's the reason why. I don't think he was, you know, just kind of getting through, the, going through the motions. I think he really did have the foot problem. The illness thing, that got me a little bit. That one hurt. That one hurt. Because, Vlad, you and I and a lot of people right now listening have gone to work sick and have done their job. All the time. All the time. I play basketball sick. Whether I'm supposed to or not, that doesn't matter. And it doesn't help that you were out hanging out the other night the night before or the day before with all these guys. And now you're at the F1 race, hanging out, doing all this nonsense. And you ask yourself, and now you're seeing pictures of like Michael Jordan and stuff. Would Michael Jordan have done any of that? Scotty Pippen. All right. So, no, so, we know, no, we know Dennis Rodman would. So stop with the, uh, he's like, more Dennis Rodman than Michael Jordan. Let's start with what these old people would have done back in the days. They didn't have that. There wasn't that many stuff out there like it is right now in 2024 to distract you. If I so, was playing, Boston would be at home. I mean, that's what he thinks. Okay. I mean, you can't knock the man if he thinks that. Look, another quote from Jimmy Butler at the Miami Grand Prix. I love that this is here in Miami, a city I adore and that I love. We, we have no doubt, Jimmy, that you love the city. Maybe you love it a little too much sometimes. I guess just everybody's kind of frustrated right now. Give that man his extension, though. As much as I'm giving him a hard time, give us an extension. Let's get it going. You really want him back. I don't think I do. You, but do you want to be do? stuck? But then you want to be stuck with the same situation for the next three to for the next three years? You know what? I've given up. Because you as you, you don't get you don't get help. I mean, when you get older, you get more like you know, susceptible to getting injured even more. Yeah. It's true. You usually get worse as you get older. You might get wiser. Usually, LeBron James, he's still good. Yeah, well, I mean, some unless Jimmy's willing to spend two million dollars on his body to make sure that it's a, you know it's 
it's taken care of. I don't think he likes to do that. He wants to make coffee, ride horses, and drink Michelob. And F1 and be rumored to date Shakira. And another thing that needs to be pointed out, Jimmy, I will never go for the tie. I'll always go for the win. And that's like, oh, he's got the killer instinct. Well, he's missed a lot of those shots, too. Uh, and, you know, I'm piling on right now. I, I, I'm just a little frustrated. Uh, you know, it's, it's Cinco de Mayo. Let's calm down. So what, what we'll do is deep breath, Vlad. 